All right, next question. So this one goes, this is from R Ask Engineers. Sorry, no, this is also civil engineering. They say, as a high school student, could I maybe get an example as to what I would be doing work-wise in college my first year? Like simply just courses or other stuff, excluding gen ed classes. So I will say it kind of depends on what school you go to, but this is probably going to be it. You're going to likely take some form of calculus. So if you've already taken through Calc 1 or through Calc 2 in high school, then you start with Calc 3. Uh, if you've already taken through Calc 3, then maybe you'll start in a stats class or a differential equations class. But most people are starting either at Calc 1, Calc 2, or Calc 3. And then if you haven't tested out of physics yet, um, so if you didn't get college credit for physics, then you'll likely take an introduction to physics mechanics class in your first semester of college and uh, so that's the there's two physics there's physics for mechanics and then physics for electricity and magnetism so mechanics is how things move or don't move so you'll take that and then you'll probably take a lab class for that physics class and then you might take an intro to CAD class or an intro to general engineering class as well but those will be your main engineering courses you take in your first semester as a college student. And then in your second semester, because you asked first year, then you take the second half of physics, electricity and magnetism, and then it kind of depends on what major you're going into. Civil engineering, you might still take a, a mechanics of engineering class, you might take that. But um, let's say, let's go to University of Texas, of Texas Civil Engineering Degree Plan. So what you can do is you can search the school that you're going to and search the engineering program that you're interested in, and search their degree program. And what you'll find is they have a really good, uh, they'll have it spelled out pretty, pretty clearly for you, exactly what classes you need to take to graduate throughout all four years. And so let's find civil engineering flowchart. Is this it? Is this it? Okay. So fall, first fall at UT Austin, if you're a civil engineer, you'll take differential and integral, integral calculus. So that's the beginning of calculus. You'll take principles of chemistry. I didn't mention that earlier. I actually didn't take chemistry until my sophomore year, but you know, civil engineering systems. So an intro to civil engineering. And then you'll take a rhetoric and writing and a first year signature course. That's your gen ed. And then your spring, you'll take Sequence, series, and multivariable calculus, so that's Calc 2. And then Principles of Chemistry 2, so your second chemistry class. Engineering Physics 1, so that's your mechanics. Uh, um, and then Engineering Physics 1 Lab, like I mentioned. And then you'll take a CAD class. So that's what you do your first year. So every, most, every single university that in the US and most other schools around the world, they'll have a flowchart or a degree plan or something like that to tell you what you can kind of plan for. And the cool thing about that is then you can look at that and say, all right, well, what classes do I don't have to take because I have credits for? And, and then you can kind of take more electives and, and, and or maybe speed up some of the some of the gen ed stuff your freshman year because you're going to have you're going to still need to get a bunch of prereqs. So um, depending on unless you're advanced in your prereqs, the the progression of like when, when you take the engineering classes is most likely going to be the same because you just you can't you can't skip and you can't take thermodynamics before you take um, mechanics or dynamics or something like that you know that kind of thing but um, yeah you, if you go to your university's flowchart they'll do a good job of spelling that out for you so I wish you the best of luck it's very exciting that you're going into your first year of engineering and that's a good resource that you can use. I'm not complaining, nah, I'm not complaining My thoughts get complicated, I cannot explain in lameness Never losing focus because I ain't chasing payments Still playing in the basin while I'm working on arrangements They heard the kid in 50 countries, thank God that's amazing But I'd rather thank Spotify, they put me on the station